Uh, good morning, it's Obedience Mkabela reporting for Kexton Local Media and, and we're still here on Bay Street and we just, um, I just had a conversation with two gentlemen who live in the building which is uh, seen behind me. Uh, they're confirming that some of the business owners on the streets, they try to come here at around 8 o'clock, half past 8 to try to you know, open their shops, maybe uh, they were opening for uh, uh, their shops for the business day and uh, the police came and closed them down because of it is not safety for people to be parading uh, on the streets. And uh, um, uh, as you can see, some of the buildings are still closed behind me and the road uh, uh, you know, is still damaged and stuff like that. So at this moment, uh, we're still uh, hoping to you know, get more people to speak to us. And, 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 and I spoke to uh, uh, Musa Shawan and Tola Ninguanya. They both confirmed that this street is one of the busiest streets and today is dull, it's empty. Only uh, officials are barricading um, the road and they have not allowed a movement of so many residents on these streets. And uh, one of the residents, uh, 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 Musa, said that uh, this situation almost reminds them of what was happening during COVID-19 where the streets were empty and also uh, there was police visibility on the streets, you know, uh, uh, limiting or restricting their movements. Um, as you can see behind me, the road uh, you know, is damaged and as you can see behind me here, two gentlemen actually uh, opened the main hole, uh, the switch main hole. Uh, or on the streets and down there there's pipes. I managed to take a look earlier on and down there there's pipes and